हेलो स्टूडेंट माई सेल्फ प्रोफेसर डॉक्टर जैन देवेंद्र शांतिलाल हेड यू जे एंड पी जी डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ बॉटनी गंगा में एजुकेशन ट्रस्ट आर्ट कॉमर्स साइंस कॉलेज नगाव धुए वेलकम टू माई चैनल आई एम गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट लेक्चर ऑन टाइप एंड स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ ट्राइकोम्स If you like the video please subscribe and like my channel and share it too let's start epidermal growths epidermal cells give rise to a variety of specialized outgrowth grouped under general name of trichomes which includes all kinds of hairs and structures derived from hairs type and structure of trichomes an epidermal outgrowth present temporarily or permanent on all most all plant parts it can be found at plant surface in manifold shapes they can be single or multi celled glandular or non glandular branched or unbranched living or dead persistent or ephemeral structure they may be different type such as hairs scales and water vesicles or bladders let us study functions of trichomes one by one number one trichomes tangle disrupt confuse and prevent some type of insects injuries and use defense against herbivores it is likely that in many cases hair interfere with the feeding of at least some small herbivores and depending upon toughness and irritability to the plate large herbivores as well reduction of frost and damage hairs on plant outgrowth in area subject to freeze and keep the frost from the living surface sales protection from wind in wind location hairs break up the flow of air across the plant surface reducing evaporation reflection of solar radiation dense coating of hairs reflect solar radiation protecting the more delicate tissue underneath in hot dry open habitats absorption of moisture from dew and fog in location where much of the available moisture comes from cloud drips hair appears to enhance this process trichomes also provides an elevated platform upon which dust and fungal spores can be swept away by the wind and water before they would touch the leaf surface trichomes can help minimize water loss these are the trichomes on the upper surface of the plant body these are the sectional view of the stem showing some trichomes arise on the epidermis dendroid hairs or branched hairs tree shaped resembling a tree in the form but not in size for example dendroid hairs these are the dendroid hairs arise from epidermis of the stem or leaf parts these are the close view of dendroid hairs these are the again dendroid hairs having arise on stem parts 
these are the ultra microscopic view of dendroid hair stellate hair the hairs are branched at their base forming tiny spike tuft such hairs are said to be stellate which means star shaped these are the star shaped hairs arise on the stem part or the leaf epidermis these are the again stellate hairs arise on the branches petiole scales and plaited hairs plaited hairs they are a plate or shield shaped dry appendages that covers the plant body are called scales or plaited hairs these scales may be sessile or branched they are most usually found on underside of the leaves protecting the breathing pores of the plant called stomata they are developed on some young birds and give protection against desiccation as they cover maximum surface area they give protection and check transpiration rate effectively they are the scales arise on the epidermis bladders and water vesicles in some members some of the epidermal cells produce sessile or stalked vascular structure called bladders or water vesicles these are living and stored water bladders are unicellular and have large vacuoles and then thin film of cytoplasm they are present on the young leaves and stems the collect high collect the light which is then received by specialized light receptors also called preceptors and use for physiological reaction these are the bladders or vesicles having water filled in it root hairs they are enlargements of special epiblema cells called trichoblast and occurs in a particular zone a root hair cell has vacuolated protoplast with nucleus present towards the apical part of hair they are specialized to absorb water from soil they also hold soil particles these are the root hairs arise from the epidermis and they are about 50 mu micron in length and they absorb water and adhere the soil particles in it glandular hairs are collators they are specialized trichomes with a globular multicellular head and distinct foot embedded in the epidermis they are found in the leaves bird scales and stipules of many plant they are glandular head secretes sticky poisonous substance and gives protection to the plant body the glandular hairs of the insectivorous plant catch and digest the insect by secreting various enzymes these are the glandular hairs and on the top they are head like structure and these hairs they are arise from the epidermis these are the again some pictures of glandular hairs they are the uh, glandular hairs of jatropha arise on the petioles leaf thank you for watching my video please subscribe like and share
see you in my next video thank you thank you very much